Hi everybody, I'm going to show you the new uh, lens spacers that we have uh, and how it works and why we change it. So this is one of the pro lasers and I have here also the old regular 10 watt, this is not a pro. Uh, I have here a 20 watt as well. So one of the main things was the thickness of the lens with the thickness of the spacer so it's really easy to use so once you remove the lens you want to have the base like this a little bit of a residue of the glue the original lens came in um, so once you have the lens there you know this lens is already dirt dirty so don't worry don't don't grab it like this so grab it on the sides and if you have gloves better uh, just put the lens in like so the lens all there, then you put the spacer there, you know, and you grab your laser and you screw this back in in place, just like so. So uh, if you don't tie this properly, you hear a little rattle, you know, it's a little rattle there. So just tie it up there. You want to feel like stocks in there don't push it you will crack the lens there's no movement no rattle, rattle inside this so it's the same housing for both lasers pros and no pros and also it's the same housing for 10 and 20 watts so let's put it on the 20 watt here so i'm gonna put it here the 20 watt here you go There isn't the 20 watt again there is no rattle at all so one of the biggest difference is the height and on the old spacers we have a little bit of a uh, hat that goes up that was meant for this to go inside this circle to ensure that this is center but it doesn't make much sense anymore since the round area that we have, the diameter is about the same. So when this goes inside, it's going to be center either way. And now the round is big enough to account for the new bro with the black sticking out. So this will fit all the machines. It's one spacer to rule them all. So. Uh, you can see that all our spaces has there the name lens spacer a live pixel and if anyone is thinking that oh you just put a washer we did not we actually measure this and custom send this to a manufacturer in uh, South Carolina so these are US made 100% brass and custom make for us thank you